Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas. So after that disaster that was the last episode, you can see our funds are dwindling away here. Um, we had to move again to a different planet, so let's have a look at the navigation here. So we moved um, from here, or sorry, we moved from the Great uh, Great George, or Great Gorge, to um, Baranda, and, or was it one of these two, I can't remember which one it was, but now we have, we've had to move to June. Uh, it was only an eight day jump because there was no real contracts there that we could take. So we've decided to move into June area to uh, do some raiding because we desperately need cash, but we've found a warehouse that we could probably steal some stuff from, so we're gonna drop down and do that, and then hopefully try and get out of the system. Um, we may be able to pull off another one after that, but we definitely need money. So the one thing that I did do though, uh, if we go to the mech bays real quick, um, the hunchback's not quite back, or the centurion's not quite back yet, but our uh, hunchback with all the uh, medium lasers is back. Uh, it's this guy here, I believe. Yeah, our medium laser back is now up and running. Um, the uh, hunchback 4SP we did have on the one arm, just a regular weapons mount. Now we did buy the weapon mount, another weapons mount last time, the double plus. We put it in this arm, so now we've got two really good weapons mounts. We also put in the warfare suite. I pulled out the. Uh, uh, ECM suite out of here. It was only a half a ton more, so we took a little bit of armor off the legs um, and a little bit off the CT just to compensate for the warfare suite, but I think this is going to help us out as well with the uh, bonus accuracy. So with the plus three on both arms now, uh, the warfare suite and the targeting computer, I'm hoping that really uh, we can get these PPCs into a position where we can do a lot of damage. So let's go back here. We're going to uh, drop down to the planet's surface uh, and we're going to attack that um, that uh, uh, warehouse that we uh, had spotted. So uh, I'll see everybody down on the surface. All right, I'm not sure what to expect here, but we are on relatively favorable terrain. So let's get Hellcat Point moving forward. Quick, it. Don't know if this place has got any turrets or anything. I'm not sure how well defended it is. But just in case, we're going to approach behind this hill here. Orders. Calling out. So that hunchback's a lot faster. Lots of medium lasers on it. Standing by. I copy. See how it runs in this mission. It's the first time we've had that laser back out. It's also got the uh, stealth suite, so um, it's going to be nice and evasive. I'm receiving you. Uh, should be able to find out here if they Double got time. turrets. Let's go. Looks like they do. Okay. Got to try and knock them out fast, I think. So they're in a kind of relatively good positions. One, two, three, four. So one, these two guys can cover each other. These guys can cover each other. So we're going to come around this way, I think. Try and take these two out and then take these two out afterwards. Commander. Make our way down the defilade here. Full throttle. All right. Receiving you. Yeah, I still can't get over. We missed that uh, last mission by eleven points of damage. Eleven Receiving points you. of damage. All right, Saint, let's not get right into where we need to be. Yeah, we've some reports of enemy in the area. So I gotta keep our eyes open for them. Hopefully we can pull these turrets down before they get here. I'm here. Let's get there. Uh, better make sure we're over a little more, I think. Let's hope those turrets don't have sensor locks, and Ready let's hope order. they're not long-range missile turrets. Okay, we're still in a good position here. Alright, um, don't think reserving is going to make much of a difference. Standing by. This is going to put us in sight of all the turrets. Yeah, I think this will too.
So hard to tell. I don't know. I'm going to guess no. But we know how wrong I've been in the past, so let's move over here. Moving out. Armored sniper turret. Goss, oh my god. 450 armor, eh? Well, we got really great chances to hit, so let's start on this guy. Alright, there goes 150. Good thing we go before this guy. Let's make sure he dies. Dump everything on this guy. Alright, there goes a couple hundred more. Yes, Commander. not get into a position where the turrets can see us. We should be able to clear this, clean this up right now. There we go. Turrets destroyed. Okay, first threat neutralized. I'm thinking we should probably rotate back around this side. Confirmed. Didn't even need you, girl. Okay, so I'm thinking we want to rotate back around this side. Can we see this guy from over here? We can, barely. So we can target this guy from here. Let's do that. Let's clear this guy up. Thunderbolt 20, rotary AC2. Still pretty darn good chances to hit. Let's do that. That should take care of that. For orders. These are assault turrets. I hate to see what they've got uh, mech wise that is going to be coming up soon. Alright, let's just move into here and fortify our brace. Yes, Commander. Let's get you back around here, girl. Double time. Let's go. Thank you. I've got eyes on hostile reinforcements. Yeah. Shut up, They're Darius. Need to gotta get that shut up, Darius mod. Okay, let's get in to get this turret. Moving to position. They go so slowly. Firing full complement on it. There we go. Okay, nicely done. Surely we'll be watching the heat. Almost no heat on this guy. Oh, shit. Commander? Uh, how much armor does this guy have? A lot. It's not to get to a point then where, uh... Second turret can shoot at us. Just didn't think we could kill two turrets at once. Okay, almost no damage. So this is about a three skull mission. Alright, it's interesting. Okay, Steve. Let's finish this turret up, please. Everything. So once these turrets are down, we're going to take our time. Gonna move behind the hill over here and get some get our heat back. So that when we engage these mechs, we're at uh, neutral heat. They're barely using any anything right now using the lerms, so. Waiting for orders. Just brace in here. Damn the turret can see us. Ah, right, because sensor lock, that makes sense. Nothing I could do about that, really. Eyes 
I'm receiving you. You're not running hot at all. Let's move into here. Affirmative. Armored laser turret. Nah, not bad. Let's fire everything on him. All right. Okay, good start. Sorry, right, girl, don't worry. We got this. System's holding. Come on. That's a lot of launchers. Damage minimal. Heavier assault mechs, probably. Okay, good start. I've been sensor locked. So we got three guys here. Gotta decide what I want to do. Um, Ready for orders. On the move. A so what I mean by that is who I want to choose as my first target. You gotta decide. Um, might be this guy. Like if we come this way, could use this hill as a as shelter, or we could let this guy come up and take him first. What's up, boss? Let's just move back over here. Yeah, I still got sensor lock on me. Not much I can do about that. It lasts for two turns, I think, so... You shoot me again. Yes, Commander. Let's get over here. Like, we're, Let's Going just follow our plan. Throttle. Get our heat back. What was that? That's the missile launching back too, so I'm interested to see what it actually is. Alright. Come on. Oh, oh, that's the missile launching back. Sorry, I take a pack. Yeah, I used to got sensor lock, but you won't have in a second. That guy that jumped, if it's a heavy, it could be a quick draw. Kind of... How do you shoot through the rocks? Kind of caught a cl half glimpse of it. Looked like a Wolverine or a quick draw or something. Damage minimal. Taking your sweet time, aren't you? Receiving you. Affirmative. They're round robin sensor walking here. All right. Um, Good to go. We gotta wait one more turn for them to get up here. Let's make sure we're in trees and braced. Minimize the damage. Plink, plink. Waiting for orders. Maybe they'll run out of ammo. Hi. Yeah, maybe I'm a Chinese jet pilot. Uh. I really want this guy to come forward. One of these two has to. Where are you going? No! They've got a sensor lock on All right, me. They're, so they're happy to do this, so...
We're going to need to engage. Uh, from where? There's nowhere we can really engage where they're not going to be like everybody going to be shooting at us. Let's get over here. Waiting for orders. See if we can pull him back out. Hopefully this guy jumps in. I mean, if I wanted to make this really boring, we could just stand back here and fortify, <laughs> run back and forth bracing until uh, they run out of ammo. I'm here. I mean, that's always a possibility, right? Right, guys, right? Copy that, Commander. Okay, here he comes. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What are you... Where, what? What kind of a jump was that? Commander. Got to get this party started at some point. Next turn. Next turn, we'll see if we can get eyes on... Oh, he's coming back. Okay, here comes the first victim, guys. They've got a lock on me. Yeah, I know. Relax. Crusader. Flail. What the hell does that do? Yeah, they have pretty good armor. Well, let's start on him. He wants to stand there. We can do that. Should we try for a headshot? We got some good numbers. I mean, we could take his head clean off with the PPC hit. No, we couldn't. Uh... Let's just shoot him. We need good chances to hit, so let's take him. Can I interest you in some Order. melting armor? Nice. Let's make him unstable. Fire everything. Nice. Let's, get, let's hope for good rolls on initiative next turn. Okay, that guy's... I have no idea what. Trebuchet, maybe. Five and four. Damage minimal. Can't be a trebuchet. Too many launchers. If I had to guess, this guy's probably a Thunderbolt. See how accurate I am here. Ace Pilot Thunderbolt, maybe? Standing by. Okay, Cat, see if you can knock this guy down. He's got a flail, so if we don't put him down, he's going to be doing some damage. There he goes. Guard a critical hit. So it looks like this guy might not be joining the combat after all. Ow. Injury ignored, which means we have to kill him. Receiving you. That's fine. We're good with that. Let's find out what that mech is back there. Actually, maybe not. <sighs> yeah, like this. Get in the trees. He'll show us what he is in a second. What's this guy? A victor. Oh, Ultra 20. Of course it's got an Ultra 20. Why wouldn't it have an Ultra 20? Take his leg or his torso? What has he got? He's got an XL? Light engine. So the torso won't make a difference. Where's the flail? This arm. 
You can go for this torso. Okay, Solaris spikes, directional jets. What's he got left in the leg? 73. Let's go for the torso. Get the 2% chance to hit. Let's do this. And of course, we got two hits in the torso? Or any, I don't know. Solid connection on that one. You. Trying to reduce his heat, probably. Alright, we made it okay. Damage is light. Down to 49 in the torso. That was a catapult, looked like. And that's the victor. I'm getting my ass. Yeah, I saw that. Good shot, man. Good freaking shot. Damage minimal. That's one maneuverable ass victor. Commander. Roger that. Let's go back here. Gonna try for a torso hit, most likely it won't, but... Inflicted some heavy damage. Uh, as much as I want to multi-target, we gotta kill this guy. Okay. So that Victor, oh man, he can maneuver really well. We're almost out of back and our armor. 45 left internal structure. Got to get our back to a wall. Yep. Gonna go down. Nope. Oh, yes. I'm going over. Oh, come on. You know you didn't want to do that. Well, at least you can't hit the CT back. Yes, Commander. Ah, uh, how much armor does this Victor have on the back? Substantial. Move. He's going to go before us no matter what we do here. He's going to target the mech on the ground too, probably. Alright, let's just fire on him. Yeah, that's a bit of a start. Okay. Not good. He's giving us his back, though. I took a critical hit. Relax. He's totally giving us his back. Ready for Let's try and make him unstable. All He's got a really good jump radius, though. Fire everything on his back. Okay, he's unsteady. Seventy-one, eh? Ninety-seven, much better. So we're gonna sprint back here. We're gonna offer and to push this guy's CT. Actually, does he have an XL engine? He does. So. So yeah, offensive push this side and fire. 
That should do it. No, because I have no idea why. Knocked him down though. Just enough to protect his back, because that's good. What's he got, like one point left? Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. 34, 64, 45. Stop it. God damn it. Just having no luck. I'm receiving you. All right, so what do we do here? Where's the Ultra 20? And the arm here. So let's go after the arm. 37% chance, but better than nothing, let's try and get it. Just don't have the firepower, I don't, I don't think, for this one. Good shooting, though. I'm not going to sprint it, we're just going to move over here. Fire for that arm. All oh sure, you can hit the right arm when you want to. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Okay, we gotta move in and take that Crusader down, I think. Is that a watch out, maybe? Where are you going? He's fleeing the interview. No, he's not. Standing by. God, these MRMs are so awful. That's better. Move order received. Alright, dump everything into this guy's side. It's hopefully we Affair. get him here. Maybe take his leg or something. Okay. Down to 50. Might be able to take both the Victor and the and the uh, Crusader here in the next turn. That's a good move. At least we don't have to worry about the AC-20 now, though. Standing by. Let's get into here. Affirmative. Catapult, CM1, MMLs. Alright, that's why I'm being mistaken here. Alright, fire everything on the side of this guy. The one I'm gone. Okay. One down. Target's down. Yeah, I know we were hitting that guy. Um, <sighs> no, let's just shoot straight on this guy. All weapons committed. At least we're hitting with something. Oh, lost evasive. What the hell's that going over there? Damage minimal. It's a light or something. Oh, it's a light post. Okay. 
At least he's spreading it around. That is the one advantage that we have with that guy. He's spreading the damage around too much. Let's get into here. It's good movement. And let's fire on this guy. Dump everything into him. Hopefully we can knock him down again. Targeting point now. Okay, he's going down. Ah, there we go. Cut that guy. Target neutralized. So I don't know what this guy is yet. But he's moving so that we can shoot his back. So we're gonna take advantage of that fully right now. He goes on 15. Stalker, are you serious? <laughs> he's got no back armor though. So large laser and SRM ammo in this torso. God, stalkers, man, really? It's our chance to hit. Let's just shoot it straight out. I want to make sure we connect with this guy. All weapons committed. Start penetrating. Two gyro crits. Enemy magnet. Critical damage detected. Yes, Commander. Let's get around here. Confirm. Get our stability back. Dump everything into this guy's backside. Alright, there goes that guy. Enemy eliminated. Well, you give us your back, that's what you get. Now we gotta fight the super evasion man here. He's gotta be careful though, because he overheats, right? Light damage, Commander. And he's suffering from stability problems right now too, which I think we can aid in Location by doing this. Confirmed. So we're gonna leave our medium laser off this turn. Fire oh. everything else. So I want to make I'm sure here. we have our medium available, medium laser available when we need it. Get up here. I'm gonna push him hard. Firing. Nuts. Really sad, sad that that hunchback went down, but yes, Commander. That guy had a really good jump radius and jumping Roger. behind us and uh, hitting the CT like he did with the uh, Ultra 20 is not much we can really do about it. Um, uh, 33% is not enough yet. Let's fire all this. At least it's all splash damage. Don't want to have to deal with an Ultra 20. Systems holding. Okay, he's gonna walk. He's keeping his stability. He is closing though. Don't know whether that's a good or bad thing yet. Um, Thirty percent with the PPCs. Thirty-three. This has got woods though, so let's move into here. And we're gonna vigilance. And dump everything straight into this guy's face. All weapons committed. Well, at least we connected with one. I was hoping it was going to be the PPC, though. All right, Hellcat. Standing by. Let's keep pushing this guy. Acknowledge. Maybe he'll try and jump behind us. Not that we want him to, but maybe that's what he'll try. Firing. <laughs> Okay, a little bit, not bad. Really bad chance to hit. It's actually pretty good. What if we just, um... Pretty nine. 
Wow. Just one step closer and it's like really bad. Whew. 46. It's gonna shoot for me then, but I think we can probably mitigate that damage. So let's fire on him. All weapons committed. Okay, we got one PPC hit. CT hit. Ready for orders. Huh. Get in here. I know it's not optimal. I want to try and push him out of these trees if we can. Leave the uh, laser off, fire everything else. That should make him think twice about jumping. Alright, see what he does here. You didn't just do that. Order. You just committed pretty much committed suicide. Like he just gave us his back. Um I don't even know what to say to that. We want to push this guy back so the PPCs go first. Not expecting much. I'm receiving you. Order acknowledged. Okay, a few hits. Everything right in this guy's back. Are you serious? Oh god, man! You gotta hit with one of those. Well, that couldn't have been any better. Is he out of ammo? Maybe that's what it is. Damage. Doesn't have any heat problems. No, he's still got ammo. Ammo LRM 0 to 120. Doesn't have any ammo left. <laughs> we we drained him dry. Alright, only one of us can take the back shot. And it's going to be you because Location confirmed. I can't get in good shots with that uh, PPC at that range. Reporting critical hit. Yes, Commander. Oh, you can get a back shot on him too. Roger. You get a back shot, and you get a back shot. We all get a back shot. Fire everybody, Fun. except for the uh, medium laser that is. There we go. There it is, folks. Well, that was certainly a long one. Let's find out if we get our mech back, though. Please, make sure we get that mech back. Mission. Alright, so, so Sumeri lands with the Leopard. We pick up about 1.2 million in um, stuff that was in the uh, warehouses, which is great. Oh, God. At least nobody's injured, which is good. The Hunchback, though, just lost the Stealth Axe. Can you believe that? But all the weapons are still there. I hope the weapons are still there. Do we lose it? We did not lose it. Okay, good. 
Now we don't have parts of any of this stuff, so we're only getting one item out of this. So let's make it something good. Plus five damage, large laser, nope. Uh, directional jets, combat shields. That's kind of really nice. Ando steel, ECM, XL gyro. Cooling pods, double heat sink kits, which we're running into a lot of. NSS. Probably should go with this. That's like plus two evasion. Are you kidding me? That's awesome. Look at all the good stuff here, too. Supercharger. Yeah. But I'm thinking the NSS since we lost the Stealth X. So let's see what we get. Oh, a couple of three Victor parts and a jump jet. Wow. Well, it could have ended up being a hell of a lot worse. All right, so let's see what we got here. What? We just got a Victor, man. Twin machine guns retains most of its what? Two hundred and eleven thousand, which is fine because we just made a whole pant load of money. Let's have a look at that Victor, man. Uh, wow, that's awesome. Kind of makes up for the hunchback going down now, but I don't know, man. Still got to fix the Centurion, too. So, what do we get out of this? The Fusion Core. Jump jets, heat sinks. Anything useful? Well, at least they can move around. I have that big Fusion Core. Really? 372,000. Should we get it going? Strip everything off it. Except for the fusion core. Let's leave the fusion core on there. Since we don't really have any other cores to put in there. Um, but everything else can come off. And let's max the armor out at the same time. Just for now. We can figure the rest out later. 38 days if we do that. Let's just do this. Leave the fusion core in there. So, uh, we'll strip everything off. Let's get it back so that at least we have it and we can start working on it. Uh, so let's confirm that. It'll save some cash too. I don't want to spend a lot of our money right now. Because we got to get the Jager mech back up and running. Um, we've got some cash to be able to do that now. we got some money before the end of the month. We've still got... 20 days to the financial report. Let's manage our task a bit better here. Grab, so the Hunchback. This is the one that took lots of damage. Centurion's back in six, so let's... No, we want to leave this guy up there. So this is the main lance. That'll be back in 17 days. 21 days for this. 29 days for this. That's not bad. Not bad, let's do that. We gotta get that third mech bay up and running, I think, more so than anything. So we'll do that. Alright, so let's leave the Jager mech for now. Um, so we're gonna end the episode here. If you'd like to drop a like, uh, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Uh, when we come back next time, I will have effected all of our repairs and we'll be ready to take on another mission here, I think. Um, I think there's another warehouse or another factory or something we could probably raid on the surface before we get the hell out of here. Um, it is Federated Sun, so, you know, we don't really care because we are from the two Tortuga Dominions. So we'll do that next time. So until then, we'll see you all later.